Hey, Free Press viewers, I'm Jen Zaratti. I'm here at the Red River X to scope out the food scene. I was really hoping that I would be able to find a deep fried cheesy because I hear they have them at the Calgary Stampede. But basically I'm gonna go around, review some of the food options that are here at the X in a segment that we're calling Heartburn for Journalism. So let's go eat some deliciously unhealthy food. Ready for a chipstick? Yes. All right. This is a chip dog. It is from Chipsticks. And uh, essentially it's a full potato that has been deep fried over top of a hot dog wiener. So it looks, it looks fairly appealing. I think, and intense, and awkward to eat, but I think it's gonna be delicious. So we're gonna give this a try. <laughs> Awkwardly. It's good. It definitely has a campfire vibe to it. And I am really pleased with my decision to have, uh, to put salt and vinegar seasoning on the, the chip part, which is also quite delicious. I would give this three stars. The smoky campfire taste is very appealing in the hot dog part. The homemade chip, also very good, very salty, very soft. Yeah, I'd say it's, it's a solid three star snack. It's a good prelude to a full X meal. So we're here in what appears to be food truck alley and uh, lots of ethnic food options this year at the X. So we have a Portuguese place, there's an African place that I'm gonna check out that looks interesting. The Healthy Eats menu, which we're avoiding because let's be honest, we don't come to the X to eat kale. All right, these, which I'm about to show you, are some gorgeous fried plantains from Simba Safari Grill, which is a African food truck that is here at the X this year. So let's give this a test drive. delicious. You can tell that they were fresh because they still have the sweetness of the plantain. Texture's delightful. I would, I would say this is a five star entry. This, my friends, is poutine with all the lovely poutine fixings, cheese curds, gravy, fries, topped with smoked salmon, sour cream, brie, capers, and fresh dill. Like, shut up. How is this a thing that exists? All right, let's dig in here. I'm not sure really how to approach it. I feel like we need like a lot of different things on the fork at the same time to really get the full experience. Look at that. Okay, this is gonna be really not elegant, but it's happening. Oh my God. That's stupidly good. That's one of the best things I've ever eaten. And it's not even hyperbole, that's true. You know, we've been star rating at a five, but honestly, this gets like a million stars. It gets all the stars in the sky out of five. It's delicious. This is a roasted corn on the cob wrapped in bacon. So what they do is they wrap the corn in the bacon and then put the husk back on and then grill it. And then it's been dipped in butter, which as you can see is now all, that's butter. And I'm going to eat this. And I think we should start right where the getting good in the bacony center. Oh my God. Oh my God. Okay. This, this is interesting. It's very it's salty and buttery and delicious, of course. But it kind of has like a, kind of tastes like popcorn. Bacon flavored popcorn, I would say. I may give this a four. Your arteries won't thank you for eating this. And it's barely a vegetable, but it's good. So I recommend. So of course, 
can't come to the Red River Rex without having mini donuts. My stomach has reached its limit. So we're just going to try these mini donuts, which look like the mini donuts we know and love. They're just little pillows of heaven. The key to a good mini donut though is, and the reason why these are five star mini donuts, is that they need to be soft on the inside and crisp on the outside. Delicious end to a gastronomic tour of the Red River X. I feel like Kristen Wiig and Bridesmaids with the scene where she has to eat that Jordan Mint when she has food poisoning, <laughs> that's, that's how I feel right now. Oh my God. So we came, we ate, we ate a lot, I ate a lot specifically at the X. And while there were no deep fried cheesies, which I was really hoping for, there was lots of things to indulge on, including one of the most decadent poutines I've ever had, the bacon wrapped corn on the cob, which was ridiculous, mini donuts, which you can't go wrong with. There are healthy options, but I have successfully managed to avoid any green things except for the tiny sprig of dill on my poutine. So I figured that's a successful day at the X. So come, indulge, and uh, yeah, this last one is for you guys.